you defeated the four suits. You've proven yourself worthy. The CC group leader, the card master king, is I! Twist his trait! All decked out in my uniform! Squall, you really are something. I can't believe how much your game has improved. I knew we were destined to play. Let's duel! So, yeah, this is happening. <laughs> this is great. Uh, <laughs> Okay, I don't remember what her rare card is. Okay, I remember now. It is, it's the one on top there. You may not recognize who that is, but you'll see. You will see. Uh, I do not think I can safely take, take it. So, I'm not gonna, oh, well, okay. Yeah, it's Gilgamesh. Gilgamesh! Who, as we should by this point know, is pretty much the best. You know, I think this is actually maybe the first Gilgamesh's first, uh... Since Fall of Fantasy V, Gilgamesh's appearance in FF8 might be his first reappearance. I'm not 100% on that, but I suspect it is the case. Uh, so I can, like, just go here safely. But, I'll get... okay. Wait, no, that was wrong! Well, shoot. Damn! I screwed up! I could've won that, but I misplayed. Oh, okay. I guess... I guess we'll go challenge her in the cockpit then. Uh, but... we can save that for later. I have something else I want to do first. Uh, can I, like, uh... No, I'm not... Every time. Okay! Grab these guys again. Uh, no, I'll leave Encounter Half on. There is actually an enemy I would like to fight in the Danger Room. Which is where I'm going, I'm going to the Danger Room. Uh, the Training Center, rather. Uh, I need to check something, though, first. Uh, let's see, I have one of these, I have one of these, I don't think I actually need that, though, I do need this, <laughs> I have that, you know, let's just look at the ones that is relevant for where I'm going for now, um, Let's see... I got that one Inferno Fang. That helps, I think. Oh, I have that. That's helpful as well. Let's see... Let's see, let's see... Let's see... Oh, hey, Inferno Fang. You know, I'm gonna just, uh, maybe use that. Yeah. Okay, uh, whatever. Uh, no, actually what I want to check is the dragon stuff. I need three more of those, I need... I think that's enough dino bones. Yeah, it is. What about... Okay, I need how many of these? I think I have enough of the E's. Oh yeah, I forgot that I picked up another lamp. I wonder- I, I actually don't know what will happen if I use this, because I already have yeah, well, It'll be interesting to find out. I don't have any dragon fangs. Okay then. That is the one that I needed to know, I think. 
Let's just double check. Uh, yes. Pretty much. Oh, wait, no. One more thing. I'm looking for something that starts with an S. It would be the Star Fragment. I need more than one of these. Okay. Okay. Yeah. It's not even, like, a, a big deal, because, like... Okay, here's the thing. The two items I want, Star Fragment and Dragon Fang, I can get them both from... I can also, and Dynamo for that matter, but I don't need more of those. I can get them both from the T-Rex, which is in here. But there are better places to get them. So, I'm not looking out specifically to get to fight T-Rexes here. Rather, it's more... I want to be prepared in case I run into one. Because the thing is... Uh, these guys are far more likely to appear in the training center, and I don't give a shit about them. Although... Yeah, they aren't even particularly good experience sources. <laughs> Although... It, uh, okay, well, I carded you. I don't think I even get anything good from leveling him up anyway. Maybe a better steal, but I already stole, so it doesn't even matter. Whatever. No, the reason we're actually here is for this. Weapons Monthly, July issue. Because I forgot to pick it up earlier. The Twin Lance is a gunblade forged with two blades. The two blades works synergistically to inflict severe damage. The only drawback is its heavy weight. I can make this right now. Hmm, maybe I will. The Rising Sun is similar to a circular saw. It is made by upgrading the pinwheel. It is capable of slicing into enemies with a, like a spinning saw and dealing a devastating blow. Contrary to the Lysses, the Bismarck has a sleek look. The rifle is very handy and light, but in turn requires more physical strength and energy to handle its powerful recoil. The Crescent Wish is an extremely powerful nunchuck. Some rare items are required to forge this weapon, like Inferno Fang. Uh, too bad about that. <laughs> Whatever. Okay. Uh, that's all I wanted here. Uh, where is our next stop? Because we're, we're still not... Did the game ever tell us how to get to SR, actually? I don't remember. But, well, actually, I guess our next stop is to go card battle Quistus some more, because I want Gilgamesh. I want his card. It is a rare one. And it's... It actually refine is actually one of the most important ones for refining, which mind you, I won't be doing until like literally the end of the game. <laughs> Adia's one is really important because Adia's one gives you 99 uh, lexers. Uh, that's actually probably the most important card for refining, but Gilgamesh is also really important for refining. No, Quistus, you're supposed to play Gilgamesh! Don't punish me for screwing up! Please! Uh... Yeah, okay. Uh, I hate it when the AI is slow to make their move like that. It doesn't happen often, but it does happen occasionally. Uh, let's see. Well, it is better for me if you t reclaim this in the middle, which you did. Excuse me, did not do. Interesting. Uh, I cannot take this safely, though. But I could fortify... No, I can't. Can I? Oil boil. 
Well, you cannot defend. Okay. I win. But I didn't. She didn't play anything that I wanted. <laughs> I guess I could take this and get more chef knives, but that's not really. That's that's far from a priority at this point. Oh hey, I got an achievement for beating Quistus. Cool. You cannot see that anymore. I sort of miss being able to go. I mean, I could still just go achievement get, but man, you don't know that I'm proud of that achievement. I could be lying to you. You you would never know. It felt more legitimate when you could see it when I got an achievement. Uh, but at the same time, I don't need to worry about turning off my, going on offline mode in Steam. So you know, there's ups and downs there. <laughs> Oh wait, I used a Dia this time by mistake. Whoops! Okay, I pretty much need to play here. Otherwise my work will be undone. I mean, I don't need to win this time, so let's play it safe. She did not play Gilgamesh. Mesh. Uh, I think this is a good time to cut off, though. Uh, I will, I will return. I want Zell, not Dia, when she actually plays Gilgamesh. So see you in a minute, probably. Oh, right, fucking now. Uh, turns out I don't need to cut after all. I. I was secretly hoping that would happen. Uh, that's an eight. Okay, I mean, I think this is still a good play. Yep, definitely a good play. Uh, that's five and that's three, so this is safe. We got Gilgamesh! And also some other stuff I don't care about. Okay, uh, now that that's taken care of, we can go to our next destination. Uh, as I was saying, I don't know if the game actually- I don't remember if the game actually tells you where to go next. But, uh, it's, uh, I'll tell you now, it's Fisherman's Horizon. We are not going to Fisherman's Horizon, though. <laughs> I have other stuff I want to do now, uh, which is, frankly, uh, I'm gonna probably spend the next two episodes, maybe one and a half episodes, depending how it goes. Uh, I have one detour I want to make for a card thing, but other than that, it's gonna be, I don't want to go this way. It, I'm going to be basically doing some grinding. Because I want to get to level 20 with Squall and the other two. And I also want to pick up some items for... specifically for refining weapons. Which is what I was checking earlier, as well, actually. Uh... Later on, I'm going to want to be in around level 30, for mostly for drawing magic, actually. But, uh... No, for now, I want I want the weapons. <laughs> uh, I'm doing this now, basically to save me some time, so I don't need to do it later. What the heck is this? Oh, it's the missile base. Uh, but before I do any of that, I'm going to Galbania here. Because... Uh, as I said, we will be going to Fisherman's Horizon, uh, relatively soon. At least plot-wise, it's the next place we'll be going. However, it will also be the last place where it's actually really convenient to go to Fisherman's Horizon. Uh, after we go 
this next time, it's gonna be a pain in the ass to get back there. So, uh, now is an excellent time to do something here, which will sort of require us to go to Fisherman Horizon to finish up. Uh, you'll see when, I, when we... This is something I've actually talked about before now, but, uh, you'll see. This is not where I want to be, though. I mean, I always get freaking lost in Galpatia. <laughs> Man, I've taken- you know, I can maybe upgrade a weapon then, though. That's here, right? Not right here, obviously. Um, this one? There it is. I can almost make that. If I had one more turtle ship, no. If I had one more star fragment, I can make that. I can make this. And this. Mm, I think I have enough dino bones that I can afford to do that. As long as there's nothing else that needs it. Uh, if I had a fear fragment, I could do that, but I wouldn't because I want... I, I would rather go straight to this with Zell. But I need dragon skin for that. Uh, I need a dynamo stone for the Bismarck. I mean, it's better than nothing. You know, I should actually card my cards. I don't think I have too many that I can actually cartify, but you know, we'll do what we can. That I can and I'm willing to cartify, <laughs> I should say. That's another turtle shell. Uh, I cannot do that. Cannot do that. Wait. I guess I can. How much dark ammo do I have? Hmm. I will definitely do that one. Uh, how far do I want to go? To here would be fine. I want- Oh, Angel's 100 back collections! What the hell is the Dia then? Oh, it's the Royal Crowns. Okay then. Uh, incidentally, Gilgamesh is 10 Holy Wars. Which, I don't even remember what that does, to be honest. I just know that it is a extremely useful item. Uh, we'll, we'll see. We'll see when we get there eventually. Yeah, I'll do that, I will do that, I will do that, and I will do that. Okay. Oh, I can just straight up- no, I, I'm already using the card mode. Ha. Huh. Okay then. Still can't do this, so may as well do this. May as well. We will be using it later, so... And I sort of may as well do this, because none of that is really important. It would be nice, though, but no. Not yet. Okay, uh... I've seen, it seems I've run around the whole of Galbadia. But we finally got to where I wanted to be. Which would be the, uh, Carthaway Mansion. We're just gonna save out front. I have my daughter's card, but I don't use it in my hand very often. However, I will think about it if you give me your Ifri card. Of course, you will need to beat me to get my daughter's card. Okay, so yeah, I'm doing this now. Uh, the reason I wanted to do this now, just to be clear, uh, is because in order to get Ifri back, we will need to play someone in uh, Fisherman's Horizon. And... Losing Everett is not really that big a deal. It'll annoy me because it's one of the cards I actually like to play. <laughs> but I can just use, I can just sub in Mino Tar. 
Oh, actually, I've done this wrong. I need to win now, because I've used all of my rare cards. And that won't do. <laughs> that won't do at all. Gee, maybe I shouldn't have sold all of my crappy ones before I came here. No, it'll be fine. I definitely have four bad cards I can use in addition to Ifrit for him to take Ifrit from me. And now I have one more! What do I even want? Let's do that. That's probably fine. Okay. One, two, three, four. Actually, I have two of those. That should give me something good. I have eight of these, man? What the hell do you turn into? Whatever. Uh, and... e free. Now we are going to deliberately lose so that he takes e free off of us. It's only trade one, although I would not care if he took every one of these, to be honest. It would not be a big deal. Aside from e free, these are all bad cards. Okay, and I've still managed to freaking not lose. You are really bad at this game. <sighs> not, not that I should be talking. But come on, I was literally trying to lose. Seriously? Nah, I'd rather have that. It refines into something better. I think. Well, I know what it refines into, at least. Okay, let's just... Give us something safe to play against. Yep. I will accept it gratefully. I lost I lost the Everett card you gave me the other day. To whom you ask? The former Galbadian Garden Master, Martin. We've both been persecuted by idea. Uh, so yeah. If you will recall, that guy is hanging out by the mayor's house in Fisherman's Horizon. But now we have to actually not throw. Because we want that card. I, I mean, well, we've already done this, so we may as well take it anyway. Uh, as seems to be becoming a running theme, I don't actually remember what Renault's card does. But, I mean, it's pretty good, right? <laughs> Probably. Probably. Uh... There she is. Okay, it's actually genuinely bad to play. Renault's card is not a good card. <laughs> but it does refine into something good. I am almost... Well, no. I am certain, because all the face cards refine into stuff that's good. Some more good than others. If we're being real, but still. It is most certainly worth holding on to. Even if I do think Ifrit's card is more useful than the actual card game. Anyway, we're gonna stop up here. Join me next time when I go hunt down some very specific enemies to force some very specific drops. And I just sort of have fun with the combat system in this game a bit. Until then, this has been Let's Play Final Fantasy VIII with Kiss Blue. And have a great day. Bye!